Alright, I'm playing Lawn for the first time. This is some sort of VR cyberpunk game. And, uh, some people have given it positive reviews and some negative, so it's pretty, pretty mixed right now. Uh, this is my first time trying it. Um. Okay. Arm scale. Never seen that. What are we doing now? Oh, I'm walking around. Um, and I think, I think I've heard this is kind of like Boneworks meets like maybe Half-Life Alex or something. Cause yeah, there's like some sort of physics and you have this inverse kinematics. So I guess, yeah, we can pick up stuff and throw it and it'll interact with the environment. The whole body is a disturbing element. Hindering the soul from the acquisition of knowledge. All right. And so, yeah, we're going to physically interact with everything. So some older VR games, your hands would just go through everything. But, you know, now most games are putting some real physics. Uh, so there's a replay mode. Unlock levels by playing the campaign. All right. Can I touch now? All right. So I don't know what the controls are. I'm pressing buttons. So there's jump. I'm pressing the touchpad, nothing. And uh, it doesn't have index finger tracking. Like, I can only... I can't do individual fingers. I can... With the trigger, I can do my index finger. My thumb... I can't even make my thumb go down. And the, uh, yeah, these, these arms don't... aren't at all where my actual arms are. So like my elbows in real life are out right now, but these elbows aren't. So they're like these arms are like more like up in my coming out of my neck. So that's weird. Arena mode, parkour mode. Uh, happy holidays. Thank you for playing lawn. Oh here, here's the menu. Okay. Options. Let me see options. Uh, all right. Controls. I'm gonna physically turn so none of this will matter. Um, okay, we'll just go back and we'll start game. The world we live in is changing. A world where mankind is increasingly at uh, I'm on the ground. So Why am I? I'm receptor in the human mind. <laughs> Why am I on the ground? Away, modified and replaced to create a future of cybernetic beings. So I'm just crumpled on the ground here. Oh, now I'm standing. Okay. Oh, I accidentally pressed the uh, right, the right stick. Can I just jump over this? Yeah, I can jump over it, but uh, well, let's try what it's saying. So... Okay, yeah, he just slowly stands up. Can I knock this around? Yeah. Alright. What, what's going on? I'm stuck. I'm stuck here. I can't... I can't move away from this now. Yeah, I heard this game is buggy, so... Now I see what you're talking about. Um... Yeah. I can't, I can't, <laughs> I can't get away. Let me see if I can uh, grab onto this and climb over. Uh, yeah, I'm stuck here. Maybe if I hit close on that, maybe that's the issue. Okay, now, yeah. That menu that was over there, I had to hit close on it to be able to move. I mean, come on, there's stuff like that. Like, that's, that's something you gotta fix. 
guess I can't pull this up. Can I jump up here? Let me see. Alright, yeah. Okay, so we'll go across there. Got it. Uh, take out the gang leader, reward 200 credits. Should be easy. Maybe I'll find a weapon around here. Close. So, uh, I guess we gotta climb down this chain. Mm. I'm just gonna drop. Yeah, you can drop it and grip. Alright. Yeah, when I do videos, I do all phys physical turn, and in most games I do all physical turn, but like I've been playing a lot of Valheim in VR lately, and that's a game where like you're doing so much grinding, where it's just like, you can't stand the whole time, because I've spent over 100 hours in that game, grinding and mining, and so uh, I've, been, I've been doing smooth turn with that one. Press to perform a jump. I already know that. What's this cat? Some people grow up to be criminals. Some grow up to catch them. If I sound congested, it's because I am right now. Oh, we got a crowbar. I don't... Okay. Yeah, so when you get this little menu... Now, I'm stuck in a little circle. I don't like that. But that's they're doing that intentionally to, I guess, to force you to deal with this. Punch with your fist by holding grip. Use any object as a weapon. You can grab and pull enemies too. A crowbar. Well, you didn't need to say that. I, I can see what it is. All right, come here. Are you trying to do a uh, back fist, spinning back fist? Come here. Guys are easy. Are these lounge version of the combine? What the fuck? Oh, you're behind me punching me, huh? Okay, let's try fist now. He is a bat, so let's take him out. Alright, I'm gonna. I can't get my thumbs in. What? If you punch with your thumbs out like that, you're gonna get fucked up. But yeah, there's no way, no way to get my thumbs in. Uh, I'm seeing. Yeah, that works. Okay. I can pick up this bat. So maybe it'll, if I do grip, maybe it'll fly to me. Yeah. Can I, yeah, I can, I can double hand it. I, think I like the crowbar better. Well, you can, you can double hand that one too. All right. Where, can I put this away? Okay. I think I just went into like my my inventory in the back. Yeah, that's good. Alright, well I can take the bat too then. Come here. Put this on my left. Now can I get a bat and a crowbar at the same time? Well there you go, that's cool. Alright. So what do I gotta push this? Sometimes it's fun to just break shit. Oh, can I, can I, can this explode? I don't know where my health is. Hmm. Is there inventory in the lower back? No. Okay, if you click the uh, if you click the left stick, you can you can run. Okay. You might get a little more reach with the bat, so maybe I should have two bats. Okay. Looked like it went through the other bat the first swing, but now it's staying. 
and see what the crowbar does. Same thing. Let's see if we can hang the crowbar. Yeah, you can. All right. This is a weapon. Move the right thumbstick down to crouch. Well, that's okay. It's not. Maybe I have to physically. So I, I'm standing, you know, in real life, and uh, okay. Uh, see, I, let me turn. How do I get the options? Turn this off. No, I would like that to be off, but all right. Because when I press down, it ends up. Um... Okay, so going going up and down is kind of analog. It's not just like you're either standing or not. You're there's all these variations in between. That's that's interesting. Gun now. A pistol. Where? Oh, like that? These things are kind of annoying. Press button to shoot. That's. Yeah, these are in the way. Take these out. Put them somewhere else. So, what do I put this here? What? What's this thing? Is that the holster? What, what is this little bowl? Um, let me see. If I take this out, can I put this in my backpack? It doesn't look like it. Get out of here. I guess what? I can only hold... Oh, wait. Okay, you can just put multiple in the same spot. All right. Hmm. So this is the holster spot, but then it because if I put the gun, okay. I don't know. Maybe that's what this is supposed to be. And then the gun moves over here. I don't know. Recharge magazine. Place the magazine in the top port? That? What is... Press recharge magazine button. Okay, nothing's happening. Oh, there you go. Huh. Well, these ones were already new, so I don't think that did anything. Table, but I can't. What are we doing? Grab magazine, place in magazine slot, release to equip and slot. Come here. What are you just gonna? You're just gonna stand there? Oh, you're armed. Okay. I didn't realize that. Uh oh. This arm coming out of my face is very odd. I'm, oh, I can look inside the arm. Damn, that was a scorpion. Where the fuck, who the fuck is shooting at me? I 
don't see anybody. If I let go of my gun, well, probably I'll just drop, yeah. I'm just gonna physically duck. Okay, that works good. I, I, I like using, I just like a physical duck rather than using a, a duck button. So that's good. Okay, that that worked fine. Ghost member Chad. Last night's mission was a breeze. All of these lore weapons were just there for the taking. We're going to cause some havoc now. Drink this. Does this. First, I thought it said Sega. Now it says beer. Hive car online. Please enter. Guess we're back at our apartment. Believe it or not, I have never seen Blade Runner. It's one of the one of the many movies that I need to see. Beer, it's the best damn drink in the world. Beer, it's the best damn drink in the world. I can't even fucking drink it though. Don't make a dialogue line about beer if I can't drink it. Um, let's try to break this. No. Uh, so... Three, four, four, four? What does that mean I need to do a code somewhere? If I move my arm, is it gonna move stuff? Yeah, it moves stuff. Oh, Jesus, that breaks easily. Damn. Isn't that an 80s movie? This sound. I don't know. Is this supposed to be a basketball? Get off my. Uh, I guess you want me to go over here and uh, accept the call. Oh, hello. Good morning. Or should I say evening? How was the job last night? Ah, uh, the usual. Are my hands gonna Talking go? To stupid oh, people, I can't. Drinking I can't cold touch her. coffee and chasing bad guys. <laughs> she has a safety <laughs> sphere around Are you around calling me here. stupid? <laughs> Never. It's like fighting ghosts. You seem to come from everywhere. I can't. There's a long and grueling bounty downtown she in the won't Metro. Let me. In the end, I got our man. Great work, Lon. I uh. bet you partied in the club after that one. You know me. Train hard, play hard. In the hard, future, you can't touch one. Party hard. Look, I was calling to say Maybe that I gotta I've had the next job wait coming. Wait for the hologram to give me consent. But if you need to take some time to shake off that oh. hangover, <laughs> I'm stuck in uh, the fucking. I'm no. stuck in the hoop. No, I'm good. Okay, no, no. That's the job. Meet me downtown first. I've got a new toy <clears throat> I want to show you. Toy. Yes. You have a Let's toy to show me. You will need some helping hands for your next job. Hmm. Cryptic. Is this innuendo? Okay. There are a lot of people that are really into this cyberpunk thing. Of course, obviously, like I said, I've never seen Blade Runner. and It's never really done much for me, this type of stuff. Like, I played cyberpunk in VR with a mod, and I wasn't into that. I did a video of it. I, I only went as far as I think the video showed, and I just wasn't interested. Um, 
Push to unlock apartment doors. Oh, that's this doesn't. Well, why didn't that button work? Walled customer. Hmm. Okay. Is this a cleaning robot? Elevator is broken. Please take the stairs. But like, so far I'd rather play this than uh, Cyberpunk 2077 because this is a this is like a real native VR game. Cyberpunk it had bad performance and you know it wasn't made to it wasn't made to play in VR. But I didn't really like the story and it was just was like so there was so much of listening to you like need to get across to that high bear taxi over there. So much listening to characters talk, so many cutscenes. I just can't I can't deal with that much. Bullshit. I okay. Need to, I need to play. I'm still a game. be intoxicated, but I can climb this ladder run by run. I think, yeah, my hand got caught in a run. Gameplay is the most important thing to me. Hey, Lon. Luna, don't do that. Just testing out your micro wireless inductive receiver. Don't do what? My GPS sensors tell me you're 100 feet high. Find a chain to climb down and make your way across to the air taxi. I've got this covered. If only I had a rich uncle who worked at high. Why am I... I guess the, the knee's bent. I guess I have to... I guess because I drop from the chain, the knee's bent, so I have to press up on the right stick to make myself stand up. Yeah, because like Cyberpunk 2077, you don't have motion controls like this. That mod was, you know, you're just using a game pad or whatever. Can't you see I'm busy? Um. Hmm. These cars flying around are cool. So far, this is just walking around, climbing ladders, and uh, you know, very basic combat. But I don't, I don't mind that. We are just in the beginning. Going to a club or something? I don't know what all that sound of all that people. The best view comes after the hardest climb. The best view comes after the hardest climb. That wasn't a hard climb, though.
the safety of our citizens. Your weapons are held in the hive car while exploring the city. Oh. I don't have bats either. Okay, we're gonna talk to, are we gonna talk to some people now? Hey Lon, get to Maybe the drone fix, the drone and I'll scan you in. <laughs> All right. Okay, there's an actual human face. Um, so what happens if I punch you? They need to fix the thumbs. I need to be able to put my thumbs in. <laughs> Come on. Pick your body up? Alright, cool. Hmm. Here we go. Alright. Accidentally pressed the right stick again. See, I like when you can turn off the yeah, smoother snap turn. That doesn't happen. None of these people talk. Cloudiness, cooler temperatures prevail. He's gonna walk through me. Oh, he goes fall. around. Oh, you want to fight? Oh, okay. Proofs, folks. It's a wet one out there. You got any more? Come on. Is that it? Okay. Oh, I didn't, didn't want to do that. Okay. Come on. Come on. Let's go. You're not going to do anything? I wish I could loot you guys. Alright. Okay. <laughs> um. Do I do I need to do something with this? This is where it started. Drone fix. I am Reggie with the weather forecast for cloud news. Heavy rain continues to fall around the city as considerable cloudiness and cooler temperatures prevail this evening. A few patches of fog are also being reported. Pack your waterproofs, folks. It's a wet one out there. Do I need to knock this guy out? This Bane, this Bane motherfucker? Can I get through here? Huh? Well, maybe if I knocked him out, I could get through there. I think I was supposed to meet that girl at Drone Fix or something? Is this? Is this who I'm supposed to meet? Oh, I can... Oh, you don't like that? I'm sorry. You don't have a sphere of protection. I barely touched you. Are you that weak? I just touched your shoulder. What, do you play soccer? I'm not even hitting you. What's going on with her 
chest. Alright. Oh, a dog. Oh, no, he's actually panting and stuff. Uh, is this where I need to go? Yeah, this looks like a drone fix area. Dear Luna, thank you so much for the quick turnaround on my service drone. I love the new boosters. Hmm. So this game's on Steam. I'm not sure what it costs because I actually I'm playing it through a friend's a friend's library. Well, well, well. You look tired. Yeah, the night shift in the crime-fighting superhero gotta business test it. can be pretty oh, exhausting. No, there's a little not bit. Of, there's a barrier the there too. Ha ha. While you were throwing money around, I was finding the next crime and keeping our heads above water. You should try the club sometime. Know what they say about the harmful effects of excessive screen time. Speaking of screen time, you have a bit of learning to do before your next job. Wait, that's right. You had a gift for me. Are you ready for this? Telekinetic gloves. No way. Way. Where are they? Head through the I main door. I wonder where you got the idea for that Instructions are on the right. Head through the main door, is that what you said? Mm, oh, up there or something? Um, what do I just climb up here? Mm, no. The jump is very floaty. Um, oh, here. Okay, so there's a bit of training. Open up the cabinets and stick your hands in so we can attach the gloves. Hmm. Okay, now we're Alex. School's in. I'm uploading some tutorial files for you to follow while you learn how to use your new toy. Firstly, distance yep. grab. Definitely Let's Alex. start by putting a battery in that disabled door. Well, where's the battery? I have to go down. Uh, I have to go down there. Now, let's restore your health from all that partying last night. Point your hand at the nano machine. These robots are made of nanomaterials that will increase your strength as well as repair damaged organs. What's that smell? That's your next lesson. Wait, is this a sewer? It's a secret hideout, Lawn. Half my power supply is off-grid, but is getting interrupted by city waste. Yeah, I don't I like you this. To clear the path for the energy beams. Cool, I just went from S-class bounty hunter to plumber. They've, they've got to let you walk around everywhere and have this menu just kind of follow around, or just leave this menu stationary somewhere. Don't stick me in this little circular area. Position left right glove over an object in range and highlight blue. We already we already did this. So why are you telling me this now? Uh Okay, cuz they're telling me this. Press and hold trigger to levitate. While holding trigger, extend arm forward, back left and right to move, release trigger to drop. I mean, you could do this over audio, I think, would be better. I don't like these menus that pop up. So, uh... And then trigger, and then... Wait. 
pressing trigger and um hmm all right I don't know so I'm doing grip I have grip right now and then I do trigger okay I don't know why sometimes it's not working so I had grip all right that worked out nice fine. lawn you did it Come back here, and we will discuss the next job. I'm gonna walk through this and see what happens. No, nothing happens. Oh god. It's turning into bone works now. I can't get over this. I guess they want me to climb? Uh... Hmm, stand up. Uh, in case you couldn't tell, I'm not a fan of Bone Works or Bone Lab. But what's this over here? But I like I like Bone Works more than Bone Lab. Okay, I could stand on this and get up there. Probably. There we go. All right, where, where was she? Over here? Okay, power's up. You need to get back into the hive car and make your way to District 6. Lore was broken into last night. Lore, the largest arms dealer? One place Credits. is impenetrable. Yes. Someone took the new Lore X114E pistol. Security never stood a chance. I need you to find out what happened. If we can find some evidence before the end of the day, there's enough credits for both of us for the next week. Okay. Speaking of guns, where's yours? Uh. Ugh, partying sure does impair your ability to think right. Here's your crypto payment from last night's job. There's a new arms dealer nearby. Buy yourself a weapon at Lucky's. Will do. Oh yeah. Your glove also tells you how much credit you have left. Got it. See you later, partner. 200. Okay. Where are we going? Yeah, I think my issue with cyberpunk games is that they're usually dark and like dreary. And I, I prefer, you know, brighter. Do I need to go that way? Uh, if I can pull that thing out. Oh, then I can't pull that out. Now we're gonna have this to deal with again. Uh, what the fuck do I need to go? This way? No. There's no map or anything. I can go through here. Alien. Don't forget to visit Lucky I won't. Well, I don't know where to go. Hmm. Oh, Lucky. There's a sign that says Lucky right there.
<laughs> now you want to fight too? All right, I'm gonna use this. Whoa, jeez! I'm gonna use her as a weapon. <laughs> well, that worked. <laughs> I mean, is this gonna be my thumbnail? Wesley Snipes from Demolition Man. Heavy rain continues to fall around the city as considerable cloudiness Can I throw her on top? temperatures prevail this evening. A few mm. patches of fog are also being reported. Come on, like... Pack your waterproofs, folks. <gasps> it's a wet one out there. I wanted to get her on top of this robot, but I don't know if I... She, she's a little too... A little too heavy. Mmm. Eh, whatever. Uh... Where are we going? Oh, lucky this way. Dude, my first lucky customer. Welcome to the one and only weapon shop downtown. Let me help and fill up your pockets. Hey man, I have a job tonight. What kind of job? Let's just say I may need to creep up on someone and dispose of them without attracting attention. So you want to be invisible. Here's a blueprint for the combat I can't dagger. Touch him either. You got credit? Yeah. Well, go ahead and purchase the blueprint. When your glove, a number on top of a blue screen shows how many credits you have available. Okay, all I have is 200, so I can't buy any of this shit. I can only buy the knife. So, uh, what exactly do I do with this new tech? Hey, More? Pal, people in these parts go about doing their thing. Eating out, going to the club, getting wasted, and investing in new relationships so with unsavory mean... types. No, that's not the this part of town is safe and weaponless, but on the outside, you need to find your own luck. With the blueprints, How do I get find it? yourself a 3D print station. Oh. Select your weapon and abracadabra. Right. I believe that magic when I see it. Good luck, and thanks for shopping at Lucky's. So, uh, I just have a blueprint. So I gotta find a 3D printer. Um... Get back into the hive car and make your way to District 6. I am Reggie with the weather forecast from Cloud News. Heavy rain continues to fall around the city. Is it over here? Yeah. The prophecy. Oh, 3D print. Huh. Manufacturing of firearms through a 3D print station. Let's try this blueprint. So it's 50 there though, and I have zero, so this maybe this won't work. Guess I have to get credits. Oh, there's some credits, I think. What the fuck just happened? So 25. Now I need to 
We need 25 more. There we go. What the fuck? I guess because I ran into... Now I'm grabbing the table instead of the credit. So yeah, this, this does have bone works, bone lab like issues. Um, what? Okay. Now it'll work? Wait. Print? There we go. Alright. Can I... Alright. Why is it? It's automatically going that way in that hand. I want it this way. Okay. Can I put it over my shoulder? Yeah, and it's going backwards again. Okay. Well, that's weird. Uh, will, that, will this work? Yeah. Can I holster this fucking thing somewhere? Oh, it'll holster, all right. Okay. credits. So getting credits, I guess, is like getting the resin in Alex. Now, do I want to climb? What's this noise? Oh, I was, I was gripping this not knowing it. I do that a lot with these index controllers. Yeah, just like just now that this thing flew to me because I, I gripped like I tend to I tend to kind of squeeze the controllers even though I don't need to well, I don't like to have my straps really tight Are you an enemy? I guess so That shit. That's uh, that's their version of the uh, little of the head crab type thing. Let's take a look at this thing. This work. Oh, don't fuck with me while I'm playing pool. God damn it. You dead? Okay, come here. All right. Come here. Ah. Stupid pull cue. Why can't I? Okay. Let's try this. I can't. Well, okay, maybe that'll work. Um, this is gonna be very, very hard to do. <laughs> uh, huh? Is this okay? It'll move. No, no, there's, there's no pockets. And this is like paper. That's not gonna uh, stand up to much abuse and, and wear and tear. All right, well, they'll all move.
Okay, first, what's over here? So I think if you like Bone Works and Bone Lab, you'll like this. This has more of a story than those games. And I think the jumping is better. In Bone Works and Bone Lab, like when he jumps, he has to like first bend his knees. And uh, it's always made it hard for me to time jumps. What they want me to do here. Well. Ah, get off me. I guess I gotta fill that thing up with, uh, fill it up with stuff. Hmm. Okay, what does that say? This way. Okay, can I get out? Okay. Can I climb this? All right, yeah. Do we want to go up there? Even though that other thing said this way? Can I go up here? Uh, I don't think I can grab that. Hmm. Can I throw myself over here? Uh, no. Oh, what's... No, that's just a light. Okay, I can jump up here while holding this. So maybe I have to jump into that? Almost had it. Maybe I gotta stack these or something. God damn it. There. These will pro 
probably fall over when I try to jump on top of them. Mm, there. Okay. Okay, I can jump up high enough. Okay. Now we're in here. There we go. Now can I get out? Alright. Good. Is there a credit in here? No. There's a battery I'm probably going to need. Okay. Uh, pull my... Okay. Alright, that worked. On your hip in the bat... Oh, that's what that is. That's a battery slot. Okay. Life is low. I wonder if it regenerates on its own. How do I get in here? I guess you just need to. Uh, that won't come to me. Get. Get off! I can't get in there. Oh, there you go. Get off of me. Go, go, all right. Okay, there, you have to be a little patient. Can I put the hat on? It's a little, it's a little baby hat. Some light. I guess this is a dead end. I don't know if I need to go down there. Try it. Okay, this is different. Okay, a detour. Can't say I've been here before. Hmm. I get a bad feeling about this. 
Give to God. Give to God? Give to God. No thanks. The body is a disturbing element, hindering the mind from the Hi. acquisition of knowledge. Hi. To have pure knowledge of anything, we must quit the body. You dead? That blessed state you made out we of must jello? not hope to attain while we live. But after death, for when the mind is united to the body, we cannot have pure knowledge. The possession of the good, and the highest good is wisdom. Wisdom is the only good, and ignorance the only evil. To become wise is to become godlike. And then oh, the I can fuck your face up. That's cool. The body is again more of a hindrance than a help. The mind must, consequently, flee from the body. It must be purified to attain this true wisdom. Give to me. Give to me. Give to me. Um. So I need a battery. No fall damage. Credit. Sound means I can't do a teleport on that object, I guess. Uh Have a battery, you fuck. Oh, there's a door here. Experimenting on some girl. Oh, you're trying to do some fancy moves, huh? Come here. Is that it? Get back up. You're done. Come on. Uh, we request the full report of the experience with, with civilian batch 119. Complete the experiments and report back in four days. Oh, there's a battery. Yeah, the enemies are too easy in this. This weapon was um, at that guy that was selling blueprints. So now I have that. That's that's got to be better than that. It's fucking longer. All right. Do I have shit? And okay, so I could put this in the other slot. Did I 
lose any health? Oh, I did. Alright. Where's the battery? Go up here. Hey, Lon. I'm back. Luna, just seen things you wouldn't believe. A form of messed up brainwashing cult organization called Wuxin. Worshipping a colossal statue. Brainwashing? Statue? Yeah, with dead bodies left to rot. Who would do that? No idea. They tried to kill me. What? Hold on. My uncle is on the other line. I've got to get this. Okay. Why are you humming? That's Change weird. of plan. I need you to head to Hive HQ. My uncle has the energy source to fully charge up your gloves and help in combat situations like this. He also knows more about this city than anyone else. He can help us track down this cult leader. Get back into the hive car, and I'll tell him you're on your way. Got it. Hmm. Got a gun. Oh, I can't have the knife and the gun. Can I... Okay, well, uh... Can I put the knife there? No? It's either the knife... Can I put the knife over there? Oh, I can put the knife on the left. Alright. Okay. I don't know if I have... Yeah, I don't have any ammo. Oh, that's ammo. Oh, and that's ammo too. See, at first I thought that was like a fucking drink can. Is there any more? Is there any in here? No. Yeah, that's the fucking drink can. <laughs> All right. Let's try this out. Come here. All right. Oh, you can move these with your telekinetic shit. Okay. What? Why can't I move this one? Only certain ones you can move? Like this one... No, it's doing that noise, that noise too. Yeah, I don't, I don't get it. I'm squeezing grip right now. now. Okay, now it's working. I don't know. And that one, I'm squeezing grip. And it's doing that sound. Okay, and... Yeah, that's inconsistent. Well, now it's... Okay, now it's moving. It, these are inconsistent for some reason. Okay. Hi. <clears throat> oh, shit! You have a gun? Take too much. I don't get to take your ammo. That's such a blatant rip off of Half Life Alex. to a gunfight.
Oh, that's supposed to be sort of like Terminator? Is that what that's supposed to look like? Oh, see, I accidentally gripped it. See that? I can easily do that with index controllers. I accidentally grip shit and drop it. Alright, what are we gonna do? This? Oh, we're getting out of here. Crumpled on the floor again. Okay, now I stood up. Okay, the performance here is an issue. Hive is more than just a transportation company. We are creating. Yeah, I'm getting some choppy frames here. I, I wasn't having any issues anywhere else in this game. Welcome to Hive Transport Solutions. We've been expecting you. Please step through a search scanner and dispose of any weapons. Hmm. I think you've already taken them from me. Yeah, this is, uh. Need to fix the performance in this area. To keep our city safe. We've developed autonomous Hive X1 security drones equipped with sophisticated mm. technology, allowing individual targets to be identified and neutralized without having yeah, I don't know to if deploy you can see ground it, but forces. It's really the most advanced AI-powered drones ever built. Hey, Lon, who to pass on your audio signal? It's been far too long. How you doing? Hey, Hef. Never felt better. Great. Well, it told me what happened in District 6. Uh, I've got some information to share. Firstly, let's fully power up those gloves of yours. Make your way down to Area 21, our classified research facility. Security knows you're coming. On my way. to power up those gloves for combat mode. You need to charge them up by conduction. Bring your gloves in contact with the electrokinetic force generator. Okay, I guess we just walk over into this thing. Your glove displays two blue bars. This represents your energy. Feels good, right? Now, let's test these gloves out. Make your way to the training zone. I don't... Oh, these bar, this bar right here, I guess. This is the energy. Okay, so now we're gonna have some sort of uh, telekinetic power, like Half-Life Alex again. Wait, is that where you want me to go? Down here. Try to levitate those crates using mass control. I name them with the hollow droids using kinetic energy to propel the crates at speed. Well, we already released trigger to launch crates. Okay. Oh, I'm supposed to hit those things. Great work, Lon. I've got to run to an important board meeting. Each bot will take you through to the next training drill, and when you're done, meet me in my office. Welcome to Hive Area 21 Levitation Research Lab. My name is HBot. In this time trial, your objective is to destroy all holodroids in the quickest time possible using kinetic energy from your gloves. Okay, let's go. Uh 
shit. What? I don't know I have enough power. Is that the problem? Okay. Um, why are you not... Oh, I have to do grip. I can just keep it. I don't even have to throw it. I can just touch them. One-handed? Oh, I can. That's cool. Damn it. Great work. Hef is expecting you in his office. Take the elevator back to the main lobby. Go past the hive shop and take another elevator up. What the hell is the purpose of this thing? Uh, this is not the way I was supposed to go, I guess. Mm. Uh, where do you want me to go? Oh, this is open now. Right here? No. This? I have to climb this pole? Maybe so. Weird. Uh, are you gonna kill me? What what just happened? Um I don't have a weapon, so I don't know. Fuck away from me, please. Hmm. Where do I need to go? Hive car. Uh. Can you help me, lady? Lobby, is this where I needed to go? I don't like this thing following me. Um, I'll just stand still and see what happens. It hurts me.
Okay, we got away from it. What time is it? 12.58. In 2043, we changed the future of urban aerial ride sharing and opened up the world to new possibilities. We created the Hive Air Car and pushing the service as a Okay. Am I supposed to be listening to you? This whole hive headquarters section is very strange. I'm just running around with nothing to do, just looking at a bunch of crap that seems to be the same thing over and over. Go right through. Hef will be with you shortly. Uh, Hef? We're gonna see Hugh Hefner? Isn't he a corpse? Hmm, what, did you say go to the right? There's nothing to go to over here. Uh, is this where I came from? I don't even know, it's, it's like all the same. Hmm. might be the end of the video. The performance, yeah, it's the performance is still bad here. It was good in all the brother, all the uh, previous levels. But I don't know what the hell they want me to do. It's just all these locked doors everywhere. This will be my last attempt. She said go to the right, didn't she? And she's looking to the right. And there's nothing here. Um, she said Hef will be with you. Oh wait, this... This has a lot. Oh, but didn't she say to the right? And this is to the left. It has a lock on it, but it's a different color. Okay. Lon, how's it going at home? Oh, hive? you're Hef? Did you power up your gloves? I feel like a superhero yeah. making objects explosive. <laughs> Have you met my uncle yet? I'm outside Hef's office waiting to go in. Uh, he has some information on our cult group down at District 6. That's great. Wait. I'm getting interference. My signals are down. I can't get a signal. The entire hive system Batmobile. is going down. Ron, what's happening? Don't know. There's too much interference. I'll hack open the door and get back to Skyport. I don't have a weapon.
weapon. Oh no. Have oh, no. Grab sword, place over shoulder, and release to equip in slot. Now we have a cyber sword. It's finally getting interesting in this stupid hive headquarters. Oh, some money. out here mm, so what I just have to go backward I can't pick her up or him or whoever um, okay the drones have been hacked who is that oh I can block you can block who the fuck are you Talk? Are you like helping me or something? Are you my girlfriend now? What's going on here? Hey, why aren't you following me? Let's see what this sword does to you. Nah, it doesn't do anything. Two-handed. All right. I would rather. Okay. Doesn't even do. Doesn't even make you move. There's another girl. And I'm dead. Do I have the sword? Uh, what, what are we doing? Oh, you're making me do this thing again. Sword. I gotta get out of here. The drones have been hacked. It's hard to swing the sword with any force. Maybe I can look with this girl. Will this girl take care of it for me? No, she's an idiot. She's facing the wrong way. Uh... Where'd the other one go? hear it, but it's not... Who knows? Oh, shit. I can't even touch the button. Huh.
The hive energy generators and network system was taken down. I need to restore power and get out of here. Is that all I have to do? about to give up on this game. my balls. Balls need to go over there. Where'd the other ball go? I should probably be flinging things. I should probably be flinging things at these. Alright, come here. Okay, I could fling this at this guy, but. Yeah. Oh, that didn't hurt him. Okay, that. I'm gonna choose the ball as a weapon. Done, huh? I don't know where this other one is. There he went here. He's making that noise. I guess because I'm holding it up against my body.
Okay. How the hell do I get the ball up here? myself up with one arm. I don't think I can throw this very high. Okay, I can do that. Mm. Oh, I can I can throw myself up with one arm. Alright. I don't know if this is the way, way it's supposed to be done. Alone. Thank God! Signal's back up. Where's Hef? It took Hef. What happened? Hive has been infiltrated. Drones hacked. Like lore. Someone is trying to take over. We need to save Hef. And get back to the Skyport fast. Where do I need to go? I don't know. Not this way. This game needs some sort of direction or a map or something. I have no fucking clue. I don't know where I started from. Over this way, maybe? Okay, there's a lift. Guess I'm going here. Quickly get to the air car. You worry too much. It's not like they'll capture me. I guess that means they're about to capture me. Is this it? It's not like they'll capture me. Oh, I can move around. Hmm. Lab escape.
I don't know how long this game is. I feel like I've been playing for a while. And I might be ready to play something else. I have a bunch of VR games I need to play. Because I do a VR podcast and we talk about games that have come out and we're going to do Game of the Year and I wanted to try this game among a bunch of others and now I'm stuck. Um, I'm pressing jump right now and I can't get out of this sp space. Okay, um, see the character's doing this like crouch thing. I'm holding back and he'll stand up. And I'm pressing jumps doing nothing. Okay, if I hold forward, okay, there you go. If you hold forward for long enough, he'll kind of just like phase through the pipe. But I think I'm gonna move on to some other games. Let me see if I can see my desktop. Now the game's taking up the whole thing. All right, I'm gonna do uh, exit lawn. Let me look on my phone. So I'm curious, and I wanted to say the price. This is my Steam home environment that I usually use. Ilya, I think it's called Ilya's Retreat. Let's see. Oh, twenty three ninety nine. Is that a sale price? It has a a sixty nine percent on Steam. Oh, it's twenty three ninety nine on sale. Regularly priced twenty nine ninety nine. So at 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 twenty three ninety nine, I think it's okay. But at thirty bucks, that's twenty percent off. The twenty three ninety nine is thirty. But is 20% off, but at 30 bucks, eh, I don't know. I don't know. There's some bugs that need to be fixed, you know, like where you're crumpled into the ground and shit and this stuff where you're getting hung up on things and you fix some of that. And uh, I don't know, in the world, when the characters you come across, they don't talk to you. They don't say shit. Um, so I, I think they should add some some sort of something there where at least when they're fighting you, they're like taunting you and shit or something. All right, so, uh, yeah, that's it. I'm going to play some more VR games. So, probably be some more videos uploaded soon for that. All right, thanks for watching.